This is Vinandro, a good place to get something to eat here on the square in Kizoy. This is one of the small churches here in the square. There you can see. Wow. Beautiful. And then you have City Hall. So we just walked out of the church and we're going up here to see some of the remains from ancient times. These are uh, where you used to have the Etruscans and the Romans who lived here. And they have all the walls and, you know, different areas where they lived. This is right off the square. Okay, so this is just another view of this area. We're gonna go down and see if maybe it's open over on the other side. So we just walked up the road and right over there is the post office. Very important. And then here uh, is the supermarket, which is closed right now because it's lunchtime. But they have the cop right here. So you can see they have plants there in the window. And there's a carabinieri. So that is the police station here in Fiesole. And this is one of my favorite places to get a coffee and pastry. You can see Pasticceria Artigiana coffee pasticcia al cedo and they are awesome they're really nice people and they have some of the base pastries around here is a really good restaurant uh, antica fonte and of course they have the indian restaurant which is very renowned here in florence and fiesole look at that view so many of these views because we are up in a hill but surrounded by the countryside here we have an altar outside, sort of a shrine, a Christian shrine. And then over here, we have this magnificent view of the entire hills surrounding this area. And of course, down here, you have a garden where you can see uh, there you have statues, but this is a wonderful place to have a, you know, a little time uh, off to relax, have a sandwich or something like that. This is the entrance to the Roman Amphitheater. You can see that they have a museum there. So this is the archeological area from the outside. You see the arches over there in the back. There are remains of temples surrounded by olive trees. And uh, there are remains of an ancient wall you can see that is the archaeological area here in Fiesole. This is where the Roman city was built on top of the old Etruscan city. Okay, just want to take a little walk, a little bit more of a climb or hike all the way up to the top of the hill. So this is Remembrance Park. They have a park that commemorates the fallen Carabinieri and different actions and wars. Pretty close to getting a view of the city of Florence from up here, which is actually a bit higher than the villa. So here we go. There it is. Up these stairs is the monastery, a Franciscan monastery. So we'll see if it's open. Okay, so this is a Franciscan monastery. It's actually a little church. And here is where the monks used to stay. You can see the cells. I'm gonna put on my mask. So now we're going up the stairs to see if we can see the monk's cells. And you can see. So this is the church. 
Franciscans. You can see they have beautiful pieces of artwork. And we're gonna go to the museum. They have a missionary museum. That's really amazing. So we're gonna go over there now. This is one of the inner courtyards or atriums that we have. We're gonna go through that door to get into the museum. The nativity scene. You can see that manger. And we're gonna go down these stairs and you can see their poster or uh, not a poster, <laughs> um, an image of a Chinese emperor because the Franciscans were in China and they were also in Egypt. So this is the museum of artifacts from China. So, and other countries, of course, in, in the East, where the monks were, you know, here are, looks like money, or coins, and other things. And here you can see that they have different types of ceramics, just beautiful pieces of artwork that the monks brought from China when they were there to proselytize. And of course, you know, these are different drawings and this kind of explains how, you know. We have a, a poster of the martyrs, uh, the Franciscan martyrs in China. You know, you can see they were both European and Chinese. And, uh, you know, these are some of the vestments um, there that the priest would wear. So it's really amazing to see this. Okay, this section has artifacts from the Etruscans. So these are real, you know, you can see there's a vase, there's a helmet, and other things over here. You have probably pieces from buildings, uh, you know, lamps, uh, you know, uh, ceramic vases. And now we're gonna go into the area of Egypt. So all of these things are Egyptian. You can see it's amazing, you know, little figurines, Egyptian figurines, you know, the mummies. And there's a sandal right there. Um, these are little baskets and these are mummified human hands. It's incredible. And here you have an actual Egyptian mummy. So you can see this. So you can see here, there you have the mummy, and here's the autopsy of the mummy, and you can see it's from the 25th dynasty, so 747, 664, before Christ, and here, of course, you have a mummified alligator, <laughs> which is incredible, uh, but uh, of course, they have, you know, just amazing things. Here's a picture of St. Francis getting a stigma, and this is a view uh, from the, one of the monks, uh, uh, you know, quarters here into the valley of Fiesole. So, um, and uh, in Florence, so you can see it's, it's quite an amazing view. This is sort of a small chapel where the monks pray. You can see there's an altar there, and there's uh, you know, Angel Raphael, and then there's you know, the Virgin Mary. But uh, yeah, this is where, you know, a small community of monks comes to pray to this day. Okay, so we just climbed back down to the main square and now we're going towards Villa de Balse. So this is our walk down towards the villa from the bus stop. It takes about hmm, three minutes or so. Here we go. This is the road. Leads down to the villa. This is the front entrance of the villa. And this right here on my right is the Villino. So, from here we have quite a view of Florence. Yay! And we may be able to get in, I don't know. We'll see. 
Look, there are the gardens. Okay, well, it's time to have that panino that we bought. So, uh, there's the villa right there. And we are gonna sit right here to have our sandwich. So, please come and visit us here in lovely Fiesole, you know, right next to Firenze in, in Italy. And we will guarantee that you will have a great time. This is Ref, uh, DRA for Villa Le Balse, saying ciao.